Hey there guys, this pitiful excuse of a Monster Hunter episode is what you get if I cut out 15 minutes of completely irrelevant bullcrap. So, what do we need to do now? We need to do this villager request. You have to do that to move on with the game. To fulfill that you need Pelagicide Ore, which you can farm in the Flooded Forest. A couple of Log Eucharist Scales, which... Well, guess, take a guess as to how you were to get those. And you need one shark skin, which are absolutely insanely difficult to get your hands on. So what do you need to bring? Bring fishing harpoons. And lots of them, because you're going to be in here for the long haul, trust me. So once you have those, uh, do I have more? No, oh, I want to bring a different, I'll bring my Kurapeko gun lance. Just for the Native American factor. Or something. So what you want to do is... You want to go out to the Moga Woods. And... Basically, go farm sharks. Uh, do I need to load up? I'll eat a steak, just for the stamina. So I can run and swim faster for a longer period of time. Load up the gun lance just for the heck of it. And let's go on what may possibly be the least interesting Monster Hunter episode ever. Which is, of course, why I cut out 15 minutes of completely irrelevant footage. So what you want to do is you want to make your way to the ocean. Because, you know, you're not going to find sharks up on dry land or something. Also, that is a big-ass Aptonoth. That is huge. That's what she said. I haven't made one of those in a while. I really need to make those every once in a while, just so I can sleep well at night. Because if I don't make a that's what she said joke, I get horrible, horrible nightmares. Oh, hey there, Royal Ludroth. Yeah, you can run into big monsters when you're out here in the Moga Woods just gathering stuff, but I don't want to fight him right now. I'm not wearing my fighting armor. So, I'll just tag him so I can see where he is at all times, and then I'm just gonna run like a little bitch. Even though I should have no problems with the Royal Ludroth at this point anymore. Just if I was wearing decent armor, I would kill him. Trust me. No problem. Kill him in like five minutes. Also, cats. Cats must... Oh no, you're not stealing my harpoon. I know you're a cat, I know you want to go fishing for yourself, because, you know, cats love fish, but no, get your own damn harpoons. Instead of stealing mine. Stupid black cats always stealing everyone's stuff. Alright, area 10. Uh, there might be sharks here. They're, they usually hang out in area 11. So, just go ahead and dive in. Nope, just epioths in here, don't need those. I will let you live. Even though I really have no reason not to let you live. Or well, whatever. And uh, this might actually not be a very efficient way of gathering shark skins because eventually the sharks will just stop spawning. There are, however, missions in which they don't. I think there's like a one star village quest that has you gathering red coral stones, and there's pretty much a never ending stream of sharks in there. And there's also in. Uh, in the port, which is like the online portion, which you can also do offline. There's a quest which has uh, has you killing like 30 sharks in the water arena, and that will always give you a shark skin, but I think that might be like high rank or G rank, I'm not sure. So you probably won't have access to that at this point in the game. So what you need to do is you need to kill them with the fishing harpoon, which deals absolutely pitiful damage. and. Okay, Yamba, you son of a bitch. Because you can't carve them if you kill them any other way. So just keep doing that until you get a shark skin, and then you can do that villager quest. Thanks for watching. Next time, a real episode. Bye-bye.